Hello guys and girls and welcome back to the next episode of City Skylines with me, Biffa. Thank you very, very much for joining me. Last episode we worked on this little cargo area over here. Oh my goodness, look at these massive cargo trains going past. They're absolutely huge. And yeah, I'd like to ask for your help on completing this area or doing some more work on here i'd like to make it look a bit more industrial at the moment it's just the cargo stations the rails and that is about it what i'm probably going to do this will be something i'll do off camera is i'm going to completely flatten this to the same level so all the tracks are on the same level that in my mind that is how it should be but i want to find some cool props and things that we can put in here so if you've ever used any industrial style props things you know i mean all i've got to put around here is oh there goes a cargo train is like these little cargo these things here i've got a load of these that we can sort of stack up in places but i'd like to make this really look like a cool little area where maybe there's some work going on over here we've got some cargo things um stacked up we've got some old trains like on these sidings that aren't being used that sort of thing so if you've got any cool little props that you've used and you know the name of them you might be able to link them in the comments you should be okay doing that if not i will still see them they'll go into my spam section and i, I check all my comments so i'll just allow them back into the comment section again so post them, um, or if you know the name of them, just copy and paste the name in and I can look them up on Steam. Or if there's any people that got a good collection and you know the name of them, um, put them down and I'll take a look at those. But that's something I'd like to do. Here he comes, steaming in, filling up on the cargo. So yeah, we did that last episode. We sort of put this forestry area in here as well, which I've just slightly changed. They're complaining about not enough people. We're going to fix that today. Um, I changed the road. I had the one-way road going across here. What I meant to do is have it go up and over. So then here, they have to go along here to the highway. That's what I want. So this road in between here is a bit defunct at the moment until I put something in here. And then they'll be able to come in and we'll have another one-way system going there. So that road will probably change at some point. Um, so that meant I just needed to move the services from along here to down here so they could go around and access all of these. So that's good but they're complaining about not enough people so we need to work on getting people from over here in our lovely city which is oh it was getting up to a hundred thousand and then it's going down again isn't that always the flipping way isn't that always the way uh we could do with some more of this along here i'm gonna do that um i'm gonna just take out that section there there we go We've got a little need so we want to fill that up so how can we get people over here what's the best way let's take a look around well we've got we know we've got this passenger line train station down here that's bringing lots of people in and out 1143 people flipping egg so people are loving coming over here we've got we don't actually have any people living over here do we they all live over here and travel across so maybe we could put in a little area around the mountains we still want to sort of incorporate this little park which we haven't sort of got to yet i've marked it out hillside city park we've got to name that wasn't there something else oh yeah i put that down there didn't i so maybe we could put like a little residential area here on the mountains how does that sound go on let's do that let's do that also um just before whoops wrong button let's just have a look over here just before we do that oh here we go oh yeah he's got a that was something else I want to do. We put this helicopter guy in here. If he needs to get any water, he's got to travel all the way over here. I was just thinking we'll put something down the side here to help him. So, yes, first of all, thank you for your patience with the, the slight change to my normal schedule of City Skylines. It normally is, that was the wrong way, a daily series every single day. Um, but sometimes, you know, you just that's just a bit too... Let's just undo that. Sometimes you just need to sort of change things up a bit. When you're doing the same thing day after day after day, you just need to change things up a bit sometimes. And I've just sort of found it. I've been doing Two Point Hospital. I've just stopped Oni just for a little bit. Uh, that's oxygen not included. Because Two Point Hospital came out. So there we go. I wanted to concentrate on that. That was the game that everybody was looking for. Let's sort of have that built into this area here let's smooth that out a bit so it doesn't look like it's right on the edge 
There we go. We just have like a little lake in there. So, you know, you do just have to switch things up a bit sometimes. And that is what I've done just for my own sanity. So I know some of you are only subscribed for City Skylines because I can't possibly watch anything else. Yeah. Um, so if that's you, chill yourself. Calm down a bit. Um, City Skylines is here. It's just not every day at the moment. Right, where's the water? There it is. This is going to flood everything like it does. But we'll get back to it. Also, you know, sometimes real life gets in the way. Kids are off school. My health has been a bit up and down. I struggle with energy levels quite a lot. So sometimes I come into the office and I've got so much energy. I can, like, dive into... I can, like, sit down and record back-to-back -back three... There it goes. Washing everybody away. I can record three city skylines back-to-back. -back and it's just... Everything's fine. Other times I, like, get into the office and I'm like... I have my first cup of tea in the morning. And I'm just like, oh, my goodness... It's just like one of those days. And that that recently, it's been more of one of those days <laughs> than not. So sometimes that's just the way it goes. So, you know, calm yourself down. City Skylines isn't going anywhere. I've got big plans as well for both of our cities and a new City Skyline series as well coming up. So look out for that. There we go. So now they don't have to travel so far if they need water. And these people are all complaining. Okay, yeah, well, never mind. So let's have a look over here. Let's let's see what we can do with this area. Let's let's come up with something nice. So I'm going to use the two-lane gravel road. And I want a road... Oh, that's looking a bit weird. There we go. I want a road that's going to connect up to this park area over here. Uh, how big did we make that? Yeah, just sort of that along there. We could even make that... Hey! I'm in the wrong thing. There we go. We could even make that more along the mountain. Try and get this as a sort of a nature reserve typey thing. I don't know quite how it will work. And then we'll sort of come up to here. And this will maybe be the entrance down here. And then we can have our people live around this area. Something like that maybe. We'll just sort of see how it goes. So let's get this in. Let's just draw. Uh, where did that go up to? Up to there. Let's draw in a road and follow and just see what happens. Let's turn that off. We sort of wiggle around there a bit. And then I've no idea which roads we are going to connect up to. We want them to have access to this. So that road's too far away. And we also want them to have access to this. We've got this road that comes here. So that might connect. We've got this little road here, actually. Look, this is a nice one. And then they can get into there if they need to. Let's slightly change that to this. Let's go... We're going to go up to there. And then up to there. Thank you. Then we're going to go... Then it's going to go off-road wiggle like this how close are we to get to that one and do that and then it can sort of change there i don't like that connection let's try that again we'll do it with this one and that one there we go yeah there we go so then we get like the dirt road for going up there. And then we can have a couple of little bits that come off. We could have like a little shopping shopping thing here, maybe. Let's go sort of straight down there. A few little shops. Let's just flatten that out a touch. We take that. Flatten that out to the level of this road here. There we go. So we can get some shops either side. Up the top there. Let's just extend that. Yeah, there we go. We have some shops in there. And we can have people living around there. And then the entrance to the park up the end there, maybe. We'll sort of just go like that. I like this little section here. I wonder if I could squeeze a road up there. I bet we could if we tried. Let us do this. like that yeah there we go we can get a few houses around there that should be good i don't think it's going to have that many people in there <laughs> look these are complaining like mad and then we need a connection to over here so 
I mean, we could literally connect to that road there. Oh, auto save, sip of tea. Mm. Because if we connect to this road, then they can travel along here and get access to all of that. And if they want to come back, they can go round there and up here. Yeah, I think that would actually work quite well. So, let us grab this four lane. No, let's use a different one. Let's use this one. And we'll take that and we will go... Cannot build on water, really? It doesn't look like there's any water to me. Is that straight? Yeah, there we go. So let's upgrade that tiny little bit there. Uh, which one was that one? Do, 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 do. This one here. There we go. Good. So they can come down there. <laughs> I thought I did that road straight, and now it's not straight at all. Come on, people, now. Seriously, it's not that difficult to do a straight road, surely. Don't call me surely. Right, let's try that again. And then connect. If we take... Oh, let's just do Anarchy. And that'll let me connect. No, let's do roads. that one. One of these will stop it from... No, that one. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Toggle road snapping. Yeah. Put Anarchy on. Keep it straight. 180 degrees. Yeah, that's what I want. Thank you very much. Upgrade that tiny bit. Yeah, there we go. Let's put that back to how it was. Thank you. Um, and then that little bit there, for some reason, isn't connecting correctly. Let's just change that. I've got to have it. Got to have it right. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. That'll do. So, yeah, they can drive down there. Then they can go along here. They can have access to all of these because they all connect off this back road. And then when they need to go home, they can go around there. Down here. So we've got to remember to keep this one a double-way road. Round and round about up there and home again. Yep. Good. That looks good to me. So they need water. Let us run some water up here. Mm -hmm. Ah, perfect. Nice and straight. So let's just get that to the end. To there. We can connect that one. So how are we going to do... I'll tell you what, let me just run the water around. One second. There we go. Nice straight water pipes covering all of that. Excellent. They're going to need connection to power. Um, I have been trying to keep all my power connected together. Although this has got... Is, it, is that connected across the way? Where are you getting power from? I thought I'd connected that to this over here, but you seem to be running off... Oh, it's this here. This is providing power, isn't it? The gas power plant. Yeah, that's fine. So maybe with this... It's got plenty of oil. Ignore that symbol. Uh, 185 megawatts. That should actually provide enough power to this area up here. So we are going to run power cable. Is that water again? What, seriously now? Why is water suddenly for no reason running over the top of that? That is very strange. Yeah, we might have to slightly change that. Let's run a power cable up this road. Uh, straight all the way to the end would be good if we could. And then we can hook up to that. Um, it's annoying that it's not quite attaching to that building. So what we're going to do is stick an office in there. There we go. And hopefully that will fill up and we'll get our electricity. Mm, yeah. We'll go with that. So let us see. What can we put in here? We want a few shops. So we're going to put this district, which we haven't done yet. Let's see. That one there. It's going to start from this junction. It's going to go all the way around here. It's going to cover all of this section. And sort of up over the mountain. Dale Square. Well, we're going to change that. We're going to name that after one of my Patreons. Thank you very much for those that support me on Patreon. Even $3 a month is more financial support for me and my family than watching all the adverts on my channel. And we are going to go with... Let's have a look. We are going to go with... Oh, that's a good one. Uh, it's Dale Square. That's going to be changed to Trish Square. Thank you very much, Trish, for your support on Patreon. Very, very much appreciated. Thank you. So, we want this to be... Uh, this one here. Organic and local produce. Yes, indeedy. And self-sufficient buildings. Yes, indeedy. 
There we go. And we're going to add bus routes and stuff as well. We will get to that. We will get to that. So definitely in here, we want some local produce buildings. So we'll pop that in. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to demand master this so we actually get people moving in. There. And note that was industry. And there. There we go. Good, good, good. And then we're going to have some low housing. Not low housing, you know what I mean. Low density housing. Sort of spread around here as well. We'll leave a bit of a gap there. So we'll sort of pop these houses. We'll have like a little... Let's see, we'll have a couple of little shops like around the, around the section there. Then we'll have all of this filled in over here. Around this loop. And in fact, we could just do this. Zip. And living up in the mountains there. And this one here. With a gap. With a gap there. In fact, we're going to have these. There we go. And then, of course, they're going to need some services. So let us get a medical clinic put this on we can see how much that spreads around the loop yep that looks good to me we'll have this over here as well thank you very much we're also going to put a sauna in keep these guys we'll pop that up there up in the mountains sauna up in the mountains that just sounds fantastic doesn't it lots of trees over here let's just pop in a fire and a tree coverage where's the nearest one so we've got one over there Let's try and cover as much of this as we can. We are going to pop that behind here. Like that. There we go. So that covers all of that. Yeah, don't need those. And then police. We're going to have a little small police station. A tiny one. What's this one here? Local security post for local business. Nah. I mean, it's small, but what about this? <laughs> What a lovely place to live with a great big prison. That's something we don't have yet, is a prison. We need to put that in at some point. Police helicopter depot. I wonder whether we should just put one of these. Let's just put this small one in. It doesn't really cover much of an area, does it? Now, nah, let's have the local bobbies. There we go. We'll have that in there. Uh, schools. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get in our schools. These are going to be over here. Will that reach over there? No, it won't. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to add a little section for our schools over here. Let's grab this road. We're going to come off of here. Yeah, we're going to come straight down there and sort of go to there. And then we're going to have that go up there. We're going to make that slightly nicer. There we go. Excellent. Yeah, I wanted that a bit flatter. Didn't realise that was so bulbous, that piece of land. Let us adjust that. Oh, yeah, that's like a right mountain. Let's grab that bit there. And have them sort of built into the built into the rocks. Actually, that will work out quite well, won't it? If we just sort of do that. How does that look? Yeah, and then we'll have the schools in here. Let's go with that. So I might just change this, actually. Let's go. Is that adding like a weird bridge thing? It is. Hmm. Let's not do that. Can we have, please, this one? Nope, that one. Yeah, there we go. Raise the land. That's what we want to do. And then back to normal. And then have... We'll have a straight road there. And then we'll have a road up there. There we go. That should be good. So we'll have our local... That school. And our local... This school. Oh, do the other way around. Yep. You fit there. Go on. You can do it. You fit there. We're not going to go for the modern institute technology. Oh, that's like a nice little area for a school, isn't it? I like that. And then we just need some sort of park in here, like standard park. <sighs> Something they can... Be oh, this looks nice. Tropical garden. Must be placed inside a park or roadside. Oh, yeah, okay. That hasn't got a very big area of effect, has it? Let's find something that's got a nice big 
Alberto's Park. Weird but beautiful. Oh, look at that. Weird but beautiful. Let's do that. Let's have that at the top of this little mound here. Why not? So if we take that, flatten that out to sort of like a peak looking over the water. Yeah. Get a road into there. Oh, yeah. Power for these guys. We'll come back to your power. Don't worry. Uh, we'll go from... What is this I'm using here? No, it's a bicycle path. Don't want that. Don't want this. Want... Can you scroll, please? Want that. There we go. We'll go straight like that. And then we'll sort of curve that around into there. Yep, that should be okay. Let's have a look at Alberto's Park. Well, that looks nice. Oh, there we go. What the heck is this? That is certainly one weird-looking park. Hmm. Do you know what it's missing? Other than good taste and design is some trees. Let us pop some big trees. Not that big. In there. Not those. What can we put in there that might look interesting? Beach tree. Oh, grief. I do like the beech tree. Uh, prop and tree anarchy. Yeah. Beech tree. And that'll provide like a little bit of shade over the kiddly winkies coming to play. Yeah. Oh, that's not too bad. We can maybe work on the design of that a bit. Um, and then let's just check out the power. And then we're going to unpause the game and get them all to grow and move in. Actually, in fact... Did we connect that up? Oh, there we go. Yeah, we got an office moved in. Perfect. So that power just needs to run up to... I feel like I want to run this along here. And then we can always use the other sort of cables. Once... I think that should be okay. All right, let's just see... Let's just see what happens when they all move in. There we go. Yeah, people are coming in. Who are these guys here? Well, that's some hearses, I think, going out. Let's speed things up a bit. We could put some offices down there as well, couldn't we? There we go. Excellent. That is what we want to see. And then we've got access to this park. And I'm going to do the thing that I always get a thousand comments for. I'm going to put this as schools out as well. To encourage people to go and work. School's out. Look what it says. The citizens will prefer working over education. And only a small portion of the eligible citizens will go to study in the university. So I'm going to do that. And hopefully encourage these people here to come and work down there. There's flipping water again. Suddenly everybody was unhappy there for some reason. Did we just lose a football match or something? There we go. And we do need a bus route from here to here. So let us do that. And they're going to come from the bus depot, which is in the middle of nowhere in here somewhere. Oh, we've had a fire. Oh, dear. Sorry. We'll reopen the park momentarily. Yeah, I need to go through the city and sort all my bus routes. Let's just quickly check around for anything else that needs rebuilding. Yeah, everything's fine. Let's just check the traffic. 83%. Cannot complain about that. Cool. Yeah, so let's run a bus route from... Mm -hmm, this is the one, isn't it? Yeah, bus line. It's going to go round in a circle. We will start it up here. Actually, we'll start it here. And can we go around this way? Yes. So we'll go round there. Round there. And we'll sort of stop in places... Uh, that side of the road. We'll come down here to the school. We'll go up there to the shops. Why can't that turn around and come back? Well, that's weird. Okay, we'll stop here then. Okay, stop there and then you can come around and come back. Yep. And then we'll just come all the way down here. Suddenly they can't turn around at the end of a road. What? What is that all about? I haven't done these as one-way roads or anything, have I? No. All right, okay. Let's go like this. <laughs> I, 
There you go. A turning round point. Is that going to assist you? And then if you move that to here and then come back down the other side. Yeah, okay, there we go. Weird. Some Something somewhere is affecting that. And then we'll stop. Yeah, we'll stop in the middle of these just so they're not... They can walk back. And then that's going to come all the way round up there, down here, along here. Uh, I'm not going to stop at the shops on the way back. I'm just going to say come all the way home and complete the line. See, look, he'll turn around at some weird middle-of-the-road place. I don't know. So that was Trish Square. I think that's probably been added and had its name changed randomly. Oh, Trish Square via Sunset Peter Square. Oh, the names are working properly now. Perfect. So we'll see how that goes. Oh, man, look at that. 1,007 people on that metro line. This train line 5 is doing nothing. Blood Dragon Park, Shuttle Park. Blood, yeah. What is that? Ferry. Blimp's not doing too much. Yeah, okay. We could also add blimps to get up here as well, couldn't we? Maybe we'll do that another time. Good, good, good. So we've got to wait for the actual buses now to come all the way from the depot to over here, I think. Uh, let's have a quick look. Do, 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 do. This one here. Is there a bus on the line? There is a bus. Here it comes. Here come the buses. Biofuel bus en route, Trish Square. Let's follow this bus through the city. Let's 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 take a little mini tour of our city. While I sup my cup of tea. I do like every now and again just taking a tour through, enjoying the view. Over the Oh by the way, that canal. I still get comments about how deep Oh that canal, it's so unnatural. It's making me go mad. I've tried. I've tried off camera for... Oh, wow. These have got to take a really long way round. They've got to go all the way down there to up there to over here. Well, let's follow him. Let's follow him and see where he goes. Let's speed it up a bit. Yeah, I've tried for hours off camera to put the canal not so deep. Ooh. Oh, no, we can cut through underneath here. Okay, that's good. And make it so that people don't have to do, like, a bungee jump to get all the way down. But, unfortunately, it's just the way the canals work. Unless you've got perfectly flat land, you can put in as many water sources as you like, it'll just all go weird. Believe me. Believe me, I've tried. There we go. Over the zoo. That's the path that goes from one side of the other. The zoo to the other. Oh, man, I hate this wiggling up and down thing. Let's... There we go. Right, we're out to where there's no things to wiggle up and down now. Through the bus lane. Let's speed it along here a bit. Traffic lights. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, well, never mind. Whoa, he's having a race with this guy. Hey, it's a bus stuff. What are you doing going over the top? Cheaty. Where's the police when you need them? People are taking the wrong... Now you're getting in the way. Uh, where are we now? We are... Up here, okay, yeah, he's gonna. They're all here. They come. They're all gonna turn left. It's like a convoy of buses. Woohoo! Oh, get an auto save right in the middle of a convoy of buses. Okay, we're back. Yay! This is it. Down the new road that we just put in. Okay, let's just let's just follow this up here. So this may actually get turned into a national road. I think that's probably a better idea, rather than sort of like this country road we'll see how you can see the houses up on the hill we'll see how busy it gets we'll see how busy it gets let's just speed up through this bit there we go and we could also put blimps up here as well couldn't we that would be quite good aha and this junction it's destined to be a roundabout isn't it at some point we'll see how it goes yay there we go we are now on the dirt road that's leading up. The very slow dirt road that's leading up to our country stuff. Yeah, we're definitely going to put blimps up here. We may even put a train station up here, a passenger one, to help people get from this area here to um, down to the workplace. Ah, oh, people are moving in. Lovely. Down to their workplaces and back into town and stuff if they need to. So I just love these country roads when you've got these sort of buildings that are... Thank you. 
get your tractor out of here. These sort of self-sufficient buildings, they just it just fits really well. Man, that's a slope to get up on the right there. Wouldn't like to do that in a winter with a icy drive. Nice view across the bay. Oh, there's a tourist with his futuristic car. How many buses have we got in court? Hey! Our first bus passengers, they've waited patiently. You wait for one bus and suddenly six come along at once. Yeah, they will start spreading out. I wish they would automatically spread out. That would make much more sense. But when you first start it, they all come along at once. Slightly weird. So there's going to be no people for the buses coming up behind, is there? At all, which is a bit odd. And here we go, heading down to the schools. Lovely little area here. Let's see how many of those people. Some of them have already got off because they wanted to go from one side of the houses to the other. No one's got off to go to the school yet. Okay, well, that's a bit odd. Ooh, let's turn it back around this way. Right, off now to the industrial forestry area. Oh, after we visited the shops, of course. Oh, look at that park in there. He must have the handbrake to, to rival all handbrakes. And now the bus is going to get... Hold on, everybody. Yeah, I'll be changing that road. Don't worry. <laughs> Excellent. Are you not going to pull over let the poor police car pass? Obviously not. Oh, we've got a fire. We've got a fire raging over there. This is this is where we're going to work. First day of work. And our business may have possibly... Look at it. <laughs> may have possibly burnt down. Oh, dear. Well, at least there's a nice water source. There we go. Right nearby. Yeah, let's just hope that wasn't your business. It looks like it was just like a forestry area. So... No, it actually was a business. Oh, and here they come. Okay, anybody getting out there? No. So maybe they, this is their work area. There's one more stop along here in between. Are they going to get out here? No, maybe they are. Oh, dear. Maybe they are. Maybe this was their business. Well, it looks like we're out of a job. Are they all going to get out here? Is there actually anybody left on the bus? I don't know. <laughs> maybe not. Oh dear. Let's see who's left on the bus. Zero passengers on the bus. Well, there we go. Yikes. That is not good. It's all collapsing. That is why we've got this right by here. So these guys can sort it out. Mm, well, anyway, there we go. I like that little area there. Next episode, we'll get this park sorted up here as well. If you enjoyed, leave the thumbs up. Hit the big B with the tea stain to subscribe as well. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it. And I will see you tomorrow for the next episode of City Skylines. Take care. Bye-bye.